How's it going guys? It's Chris here with Street Geeks and today I'm doing a quick video on how to uh, fix an issue with a printer, a wireless printer particularly, if you're not able to print. This is a situation where you go to print and it's, it was working before and all of a sudden it's just not working now. And I ran into this issue myself with my own HP printer. So I figured I would share it with you guys. So let's take a look. So you're trying to print a document and you click print like you normally do. It says it's going to print and then it never prints or you get some type of error where it, it says not connected or something like that. So first thing you want to do, uh, you want to make sure that you have all of the proper drivers installed, all of the proper print software. Uh, check for updates. Uh, one thing you want to do is go to the app store and you'll want to go and check for any uh, possible updates that may have been released for your printer. If you don't see any there, you can't necessarily install them. If you see any system updates, also install those as well. Install any system updates. Uh, let's say that you don't see any system updates, you don't see any updates for your printer. Um, the next thing you're gonna wanna do is you wanna go to system preferences printers and you'll see your printers listed here so you're going to secondary click on this air this white area here and you're going to select reset printing system and then you'll go ahead and click reset I'm not going to reset mine right now because I don't want to have to redo everything but once you reset it it's going to you know remove all of the printers that you install, all of the drivers um, and the software and things like that. It won't, I, let, me, let me correct myself. It won't remove the, the software that you install. So if you install like HP's, you know, printer suite, scanner suite, all of that stuff, it's not gonna remove that. It's gonna remove these printers here where you see um, that they have been installed and they're accessible to the different applications when you need to print. Uh, so you'll wanna go ahead and try to print after that. Let's say it's still not working. You'll wanna try to go ahead and um, delete the drivers for your printer. To do that, you'll wanna open up the Finder. Once you get to the Finder, hit Computer, it'll bring you to this screen, and you'll be able to see all of your drives. You want to select your internal drive because this is a system printer. So you'll select Mac Drive, Library, and then Printers. So whatever printer you're having trouble with, just delete that whole folder. Delete that whole folder and it'll uh, delete the driver from your machine. Once you do that, go ahead and try to print again. It should be working at that point. If it's not, you'll want to contact the, the manufacturer for your printer and find out what other resources they can provide for you. Because at this point, you've done everything that you can do on your end in terms of your, your Mac is concerned. There may be an additional issue with your printer that is preventing it from working. So you'll want to contact the manufacturer of your printer at that situation. But that's it. Let me know if this works for you in the comments. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment or whatever. I try to get back to those. If this video helped you, like, subscribe, comment, and please share with anybody you think it may help. And I'll catch you guys next time. Later.